and I'm really blessed to be here in this place and I'm really blessed whenever I come in this place I see it I, I pray meditate and, and and speak the word and it's really blessed my heart and whenever like the morning evening whenever I'm here and when I see this uh, pedophile it's really bless my heart and also remind me about the the labors as the Bible talks about Jesus was telling speaking to his disciples speaking to you and me about the about the multitude when he saw the multitude in the book of Matthew chapter 9 verse 36 the Bible says when he saw the multitude his heart filled with compassion the Bible says when he saw the multitude his heart filled with compassion because they were sheep without a effort because nobody was there to taking care of that nobody was they don't know where they were going that's what the Bible says they were the sheep without a effort and he said ask the father so he can send the labors and today also we should ask the God ask the Lord because the harvest we know the harvest is plentiful and you know the what is the harvest what is Jesus talking about he was talking about the souls he was talking about the the people and we know that the harvest is plentiful but the workers are few so we have to ask God so that God can send the labors into this harvest field so so we can reap the harvest we can reap the end time harvest so unless and until the Bible is talking about when Jesus saw the multitude his heart filled with compassion so we have to see people we have to see the the people when we will see the people when we will see the people our heart also filled with compassion because they are also the people who don't know what is the life they don't know what is the way they don't know where they are going so you and I we are the people as as the Bible says ask the God ask the the Lord of the harvest so God can send the labors and I, I believe in my heart I believe that you and I we are the answer of someone's prayer somebody has prayed for us somebody has prayed for the labor so God has sent you and me in this in this earth as a labor to reap the end time harvest so your and my work is to pray to God pray to God that God can send the labor so that the more harvest can be cut the more harvest can come in the kingdom of God so I just want to encourage this morning each one of you to pray that God will send the labors because we all of us we know the harvest is plentiful the harvest is plentiful but the workers are few so ask God ask God the the prayer that the Lord will send the labors into this harvest field it's, it's really I'm really blessed to see and in you, you can see the the all around this is the harvest field and when I see this as always reminding me that the harvest is plentiful but the workers are few so this morning I just want to tell each one of you and I want to encourage each one of you just pray to God that God can send the labors into this harvest field because harvest is plentiful but the labors are few so us we are in the end time we have to finish the work the tax what the Lord has given to us so pray that God can send the labors as as I told you that the that we are the answer of someone's prayer somebody prayed for you and me so we came here as a labor and we are reaping the harvest and same thing we have to do we have to pray to God and God can send more labors into this harvest field so all of us together we can glorify the Lord Jesus Christ may God bless you